My name is Tyson Levin. I'm the founder and owner of Charm Playhouses, which is a luxury playground and playhouse manufacturing company, and we ship all over the world our product. We started about two years ago. Uh, I prior to, to starting Charmed, I had a landscape company that I had built up from a wheelbarrow and a shovel, and it, it's been quite unreal the last two years. The amount of changes that, as a business, we've had to to uh, work against. Uh, we've seen changes in minimum wages uh, where they've raised it, and, and minimum wage is fine, but it, it also raises the wages of all your employees. And with that comes increased CBP and EI. WCB rates lately have gone up. You know, a year ago I had 15 people working here at the shop, but I had to reduce my labor force because I couldn't afford it. And now we're down to about eight people who work in the company full time. And, you know, I'm, I'm terrified for the increased taxes and, and what that's going to do to our company. Right now, as a mom and pop shop, we're not making very much money. In fact, we make sure to pay our employees before we get paid, and there's many months that we've skipped paychecks because I just put a ton of risk to build this dream that we have and bring it to life. And with that, I feel like with the risk, there should be some sort of reward. And if we make these changes throughout Canada, I'm not sure what that reward is because I don't have a retirement package for me. If I get injured tomorrow, I don't make money because I'm not here building this product. I, it, it boggles my mind that, that the government is making so many changes so quickly, both federally and provincially, that hurts us as business owners. Like, we, we have significant amount of loans to be able to to set up a company like this where we buy quarter million dollars worth of equipment and tools and employ people and rent big shops to, to provide. And and that's just my business. I mean, this is businesses across Canada have the same issues where it, it may look like a business owner has it made for them, but they have so much capital, time and investment and hopes and dreams invested into a company with no guarantee that that company is going to succeed.